Hi, Greg. Hi, May. Hi. Why are we here today? Because we this is a meeting. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, May. Hello. How are you doing? I'm pretty good in yourself. I have been good. A hardest reset turned into a homebrewers D and D channel for a while, that's and not, we promise there's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. I've been enjoying the story. Has been good. Watch more homebrewers. But no, it's been good to finally sit down and work on a video. And for those who didn't watch when we did do the podcast, which I promise the podcast will be coming back at some point. Uh, one of the last episodes that we did was you were telling about a new game you were playing at the time. This was a while ago. A while. This was like October of last year. Yes, it was. Uh, at the time, new game you've been playing called Twisted Wonderland. You explained that it was a game that was created with Disney and the mangaka from Black Butler, and they turned all the Disney villains into pretty be shown in boys and turn it into a gotcha game. And... You've been playing this game a lot, and you recently have been laughing because you've started showing me the wonderful merch <laughs> that has come from this game. Yes. And apparently Disney will just throw their money at fucking anything for merch. <laughs> yeah. So how how did you realize that the merch was so lit for Twisted Wonderland? Well, Twitter is a magical place. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And Which can I say shout out to all of your uh, mutuals on Twitter who may or may not be watching this video when it comes out. I want to say hi to everyone. Hi. Hi. There's May. Hi. There she is. Hi. How how, how, we already know how you're I'm doing. I'm good. You're doing good. Hell yeah. yeah. Uh, but yeah, so you're talking Twitter is a wonderful place. Yes. And there is a Twitter page. I forgot. I think it's like, I can't remember the name of it. I'll look at it up. But it just posts all kinds of merch, and that's how I and find it. And this is legit This merch. is, like, legit merch. You can buy all this. This is legit. I want, I've actually I want have everyone. pre-ordered a couple of Oh, God. I want everyone to know, this is not a shit post. No. I mean, this video is a shit post. But Don't legit, get that wrong. All the merch you're going to see, you can actually buy. This is all legit merch. Yes. All legit merch. I want you to know. And what is going on with your... Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh-oh. What did you do? You broke the computer. No, you're good. I didn't break the computer. The cat broke the computer. The cat broke the computer. Oh, no. My cat. The cat on my right, desktop. Right. So you're going to show me the wonderful merch of Twisted Wonderland. Now, I don't know any of what you're going to show me. You've you know, told me You've told me about a couple pieces of merch that have happened. You've texted me while at work. <laughs> you know, I'll be like, I'll be on my break at work. And all of a sudden, I look at my phone. It's like, Greg, there's new merch. And I'm like, oh, God. Okay. <laughs> That's fair. Yeah. I am excited. And you have gone on a deep dive. I did. To find some merch. So. Some that you've seen, some of some that you ha haven't. I am so excited. So, take me on a journey. All take right. me on this wonderful journey of twisted merch. Like like Willy Wonka? Like, the chocolate factory? Yes. Like right. Willy Wonka and the Fudge Factory. Factory? All right. It's not the Fudge Factory. No. All right. All so, right. we're starting with... Um, my figure collection. This is not where you can I buy merch. I haven't heard that name in so long. My figure collection. Okay. But you can see all the wonderful merch. Oh, boy. So you know what? Because I'm a girl. And girls use purses. Oh, <laughs> they've got purses. We're going to look they've, at purses. They've got purses. But at least, you know what? This is practical. You know? That's true. I mean, it's expensive. But it's practical. You can now, use this. Okay. Picture me. I'm a woman. <laughs> I like purses. I like Twisted Wonderland. <laughs> the fact you said I'm a woman. <laughs> oh, man, I feel like a woman. <laughs> okay, so yeah, okay. So I'm Shania Twain. <laughs> All right, you're I, a woman. <laughs> I, man, I feel like a woman. Uh -huh. I want a purse. Uh -huh. I like Twisted Wonderland. Yeah. I love how in this universe, Shania Twain's a Twisted Wonderland <laughs> yeah. stand. Um, and <laughs> I want a Twisted Wonderland purse. How many smackaroos am I going to deal out for this? So I think last time I checked with this purse. Oh, here we go. Oh, so the price here is twenty three thousand yen. So that's about two hundred and thirty dollars. Oh! <laughs> and that's not including the matching wallet or the ma the matching wallet. <laughs> the, the matching <laughs> fucking wallet. Are you kidding me? And also, you know, because some women like to have little charms on their purses, you can't forget the matching charms that go on the purse. We're on. I want everyone to know we're on the first. <laughs> We're on the first set of merch. <laughs> the sky's the fucking limit at this point, my guy. The sky's the limit. Oh, man. All right. Well, pick this. What? These are pens. Okay. These are pens. <laughs> these are pens. Hey, guys. And you can legit write with these. These are legit pens. They're, but those aren't... Hold on. 
I gotta unpack something about these fucking pens, right? Okay. What's with the cards on the pens? <laughs> so, you know which dorm you're getting, so that way, you know, so you want to rep a certain dorm. <laughs> it's right there for the taking. I don't know why I asked that question. I should have known the answer to that. <laughs> I should have known the answer to that. I should have... <laughs> I should have known the fucking... I should have known the answer to that one! <laughs> oh my god. Try to put it over here. That's amazing. <laughs> yeah, so you can get pens. You can get You can pens. get notebooks. You can get erasers. I didn't find them. I'm just going to tell you. There's erasers. All right. Now, how much am I going to spend for these pens? Let's look. Let's look. Let's see. I want to say... You know what? I want to say about 15. 15 bucks? Let's just guess. 110? Yeah. Okay, we're going <laughs> Hold on. Okay. We're going to go to the Cursed Vill plush. Hold on. The Cursed Vill plush. So <laughs> this thing. His name, so if I remember correctly, his name is Vill Schoenheit. Schoenheit. Yes. Vill Schoenheit. And okay. to explain, so he's based off the evil queen from Snow White. Right. So you know, you remember Snow White. The queen thinks and she's... And the seven a- clever boys. Yeah, I remember Snow White and the yes. seven clever boys. <laughs> the seven clever boys. You know how she wanted to be the fairest in the land. She thought she was the most beautiful... You know? That's why he's a super pretty boy. Yes. But this, Is he the fairest of the... Of the not owner? this plush. I will say when I first saw this, this plush. plush. When I saw this okay, plush. Okay, hold on. Zoom in on this plush for a moment. What is, what is wrong with this bill plush? I don't see... <laughs> My favorite is the hair. Okay. Because be it looks f- like a biscuit. I now see <laughs> what the issue is with the bill plush. <laughs> I have answered my own question. Oh, you can stick it on the wall. Oh, Man, <laughs> nothing like nothing like raw biscuit, nothing so, like a limp biscuit so, to put on your fucking so, wall, my guy. Oh, okay. Oh, hold on, so, hold on. <laughs> What's with the eyeliner? Okay. We're done. We're okay. done. The dryer said we're done. We are done. Okay, so the first time I saw this plushie, yeah. I don't want to say it because you know Bill's my favorite character, but I couldn't lie to myself. This thing is ugly than the rest of the plushie. This is ugly. His eyeliner looks like his favorite emo band broke up and he uh, just could not stop crying like, and his eyeliner just ran he everywhere he looks like how all of us looked when my chemical romance broke up in 2013 <laughs> he really does oh my god <laughs> and his mouth is like the mouth <laughs> it looks like do you remember on the wii when you made your me <laughs> you could do the little like squiggle mouth yeah that's what it looks like that's what it fucking looks so, like this, I call this the Cursed Vill plush because nobody likes it. <laughs> like, I, I, for like, no I, one likes curses. No one likes this plush. I see, I see the similarities. And you know, when I this when I saw this plush originally, I made this my icon on Twitter for about ten minutes because I was like, you know <laughs> what? Minutes, I was like, you know what? If I have to look, if I have to look at this cursed plush, everybody on that follows me on Twitter has to see this cursed. That's plush. like being a a fate fan and making your profile picture satyr for like fifteen minutes. And then after ten minutes, I was like, I can't. I'm sorry. Well, it's too ugly. This is the one plushie that I would buy if it was like five bucks. Because this thing, I don't know how much NT is because I don't know what currency that is. But I want to say this thing. It's 1,150 nice tits. Nice tits. That's what it is. Because I want to say for Japan, it's normally, this is like 50, 60 bucks. Wait, that ugly motherfucker is 50 or 60 bucks? Yes, because it's Bandai. But, uh, but... I'm not going to pay 50 to 60 bucks for a Cursed Vill plush. I'll pay 10. But the best part is if you buy this, you get candy. Oh, good. The <laughs> offset, <laughs> the, offset the ugliness of the, is the candy as ugly tasting as his face looks? That's my question. Yes. Oh, great. But yeah, you get candy. And it comes in a coffin. Yes. Of course it's cursed. So you know why? So you could just bury it. Bury it. Just bury, <laughs> just bury it. it away. Oh, my God. Just pretend it doesn't exist. That's right. what I do on occasion. Amazing. All right, so what's next? Um, Let's see. Oh, yeah. What is this? <laughs> They're plates. Hold on. You talked about the fabled plates before. So this is just the Twister Wonderland plate. And the best part about this is... You know what these look like to me? You know? Um, yeah. What do they look like? What do they look like? You know those little kid plates you could get at Walmart? Yeah, the ones that like you had when you sat at the kitty table during Thanksgiving. Yeah, exactly. And the best part is the way this picture is. 
<laughs> These look bootleggy. They look like that they went to a local shop and went like, hey, I've got this like, like fucking 240 by like 300 JPEG, like size JPEG. That's like way too small and they blow it up so that like it fits the plate, but it doesn't look good. Yeah. That's what those are. There's no quality here. And I didn't find it, but a while ago, I'm going to say about a week or two ago, I found plates of the Twisted Wonderland boys. Like, you could oh, literally good. buy them in their chibi form. It has their name on it. And I'm like, you know, somebody buys this. Somebody bought this. Th- that's the thing that's blowing my mind. Is somebody bought this. And bought the other plates, too. All this merch you see, people buy, have bought it. Mm-hmm. Or are going to buy it. I just... I can't honestly. And my best, the favorite part. Look of at how cheap they look! <laughs> they look so fucking cheap! Oh, the best part is at the bottom. It says. What's it say? Do you want to have lunch? Question mark. Do you want to? Hey, 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 uh, YouTube. <laughs> do you want to have lunch? <laughs> do you want to have lunch? You know. Please, I want to know. Do you want to have lunch? The first time I found this. Oh, by the way, don't forget because uh, you know it's Disney. Okay. Hang on. You have to have... <laughs> no, go back. You have to have that good old Mickey Mouse. Oh, there's the show, house of mouse. To show that it's legit. There's the house of mouse himself. Amazing. <laughs> the best part is, when I first found this, besides dying of laughter, I posted this on Twitter, and I showed people, and I said, I can't believe this is this thing, and half the people that followed me commented, and they go, what the hell is this thing? <laughs> <laughs> and someone even the fact that your Twitter meter is like, what the fuck? And they even said, do you want to have lunch? He's like, no, I want you to stop making this. No, you're cursed. Stop making this. Can you imagine having lunch with cursed veal plush? No. Oh, so you know what I would. <laughs> with those plates. With those plates. Those specifically those plates. But you roll up in that purse. Yes. There it is. That's, That's how you do it. It's the brand called Samantha something. Purse. I don't know. I don't know I don't fashion, know. sweaty. Anyway, next. These are scissors. Oh! Wait. Hold on. They're sticky scissors compact. Hold on. So, you know, you can put them in that purse you buy. Why? First of all. Fucking, f- fucking first of all. <laughs> You're laughing too because you can't fucking believe it. First of all. Uh-huh. First of all, is what you're paying for what boy you want to cover your scissors? <laughs> I no, I think what it is, it's like what boy you want to cut. Yes, I think what it is, it's it's compact, so oh. it comes in. A, <laughs> I'm trying to explain this too. Okay, it, okay. It comes no, keep going, keep going. No, you're it good. Keep going. It comes in a little tube, and you pick the dorm you want, and then you take out the scissors from the tube. They're all the same thing, by the way. These little scissors. They're the, all the same. But the only scissors, difference you're paying for the tube. <laughs> the difference is, yeah, you're paying for the tube. All this merch, you're paying for the dorm, essentially. <laughs> you're paying for the logo on it. You're paying for the. We've got a long way to go, my guys. Oh, Holy shit. By the way, because there's seven dorms, it's seven types in total. It, it needs to tell you that. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you, have, um, you have seven choices that you can you. pick. Who's that on Twitter? Uh, the This Twitter is called Twisty Check. That's the one that posts all this merch. Twisty Check. And that's, how, that's how I find this stuff. Shout out, shouts going out to Twisty Check. Oh, my God. Let's, see, what's this? Uh, let's pick on me on me. Oh, yeah. There's cutlery, 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 cutlery set. I almost bought this, by the way. You, I almost bought this. I'm not even joking. I almost did. Uh, me. <laughs> yes, Greg. Hey, you know what? I'm not even going nickname. Brianna. Yes. I've never called you Brianna on a video before. <laughs> yes. Brianna. Yes, Gregory. We need to have a talk. We are talking right now. We are. <laughs> yes. Why did you almost buy the fucking cutlery set? <laughs> because it was pretty. <laughs> <laughs> but I did it. <laughs> but I didn't. You know why? Why? Because it's closed for pre-orders. Oh uh, no! Oh, that's what stopped you. It wasn't the fact that you thought, "Wow, this is a dumb purchase." It's the fact that you went, "Oh no, the pre-orders are closed." <laughs> yeah. So it's literally a cut cutlery set. We're gonna let it load. But it's 
Essentially, it's literally a fork. You're and paying a- for overpriced spoon and fork. <laughs> that's what it is. It's a spoon and fork. That's gold. You're paying almost twenty <laughs> bucks for one spoon and fork. It has the, the logo. They on the don't door. even look like big spoon and fork. That's you little- know what thing is. <laughs> I would it get it. Like- it's probably like a a spoon and fork used for like tea or cafe. Yeah, probably. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't buy it because it's it's. Clothes for well, some would say you made the right choice. But I almost did. Oh, but then I did yes, it. I'm not surprised. Oh. Let's see. Oh uh, my god, this is... Oh, what is this? This is a trash can. Yes, the trash can! Awesome. And by the way, there's two types. I just picked this one. There's two types of trash can. Okay. Oh yeah, here's the other one. But yeah, so, you know, just in case you're, you know... At this point, I'm just going to come out and say it. You could literally make a house of nothing but Twisted Wonderland merch if you tried hard enough. Oh my god. You could have trash cans, there's okay, plates. So so years down the road, we're all fucking millionaires. You get your mansion. I've got my mansion with Mira. Kit's got his mansion. And like right next to us. Chrissy Brad has got their ma- mansion next to you. So we're all living on like Mansion City. That's literally the name of our town. It's Mansion City in <laughs> California. Okay. So yeah. Mansion City bitch. So you've got you've got you got your mansion mansion um i don't know why i said it like that so we walk in greeted by like <laughs> man me all around all dressed up like your favorite fucking be shown in boys um we walk into the entryway and we are greeted by the fine china that's just the twisted wonderland plates and the spoon and fork and then you look in the bathroom when you go to the bathroom. Oh, do they have toilet paper? No, but we're... we're oh, I hope they have we're, toilet they're paper. They're thinking we're eventually going to make it. But you go to throw away, uh, you know, say that there's paper towels in there because we can't use the fancy towels. Okay, <laughs> the fancy towels. There's, there's like towels, great. by the way. Of course there are. <laughs> Uh, and then you just look down and there's the twisted one. Like, trash can. <laughs> it took a long time to get there, but we got there, boys. The thing is, when someone told me this exists, I didn't believe them because I hadn't seen it. And then I took a little browse, a little surfing on the web to AmiAmi, and AmiAmi opened up my eyes and I saw the sign. Amazing. And now I will never doubt it again. Oh my God. But yeah. Just in case you know. Next, you're going to tell me that they're going to make like uh, furry tail plugs. Oh, I'm sure they will. And th- I would not doubt that. So we're going to go to my favorite one. Oh, okay. Okay. The shampoo and conditioner. Oh, the I've one, heard about the shampoo and conditioner. The one that made me lose my mind when it came out. Okay. And I started crying. Tell me about shampoo and condish. Okay, so. So wait, hold on. Is it a combination shampoo and conditioner? No. no. You have to buy these separately, and if you look at the price, it's fifty five. It's fifty five thousand yen, so it's about fifty five dollars USA. These are separate. You have to buy these separate, okay? And okay. the shampoo just has the one dorm logo, right? But then the conditioner has the little coffin things on it, so you know which dorm okay. you're getting. Okay, going back to Mansion City for a moment. <laughs> Stay the night. We have a lit party. <laughs> Drinking champagne out of the, the Twisted Wonderland pint glass. And it <laughs> certain exists somewhere. Uh, and fucking doing shots out of the, the veal shot glasses that you definitely own at this point. <laughs> we are drunk. Woke up hungover. Woke up still drunk. And like, man, I feel gross. I'm going to go take a shower. Get in the shower. Buck ass naked. I look over and I see... Uh, <laughs> The the shampoo and condish. And I'm just thinking, am I allowed to touch this? Is this too rich for my blood? I mean, we're all living in mansions, so it doesn't matter. But even I would be like, is this is this too much? The shampoo and condition. Why would you make shampoo and conditioner? Why would you? Why? And this is from a salon, by the way. You, you have, like... I don't know if there's an actual store. No, I. But the salon. Here's the thing. I'm glad that it's a salon and not like a candy maker that made the shampoo and conditioner. Like, hey, we make candy and also shampoo now. Also, I want to little read the little description at the bottom. Oh, here we go. It's an exclusive design. Exclusive design. Also, professional shampoo that leads your hair and scalp to beautiful hair. So if you use this, leads your hair and scalp to beautiful hair. So just in case you want to smell beautiful with your hair you get this fun fact 
So the guy who plays, who voices Riddle in Japanese, his name is Hane Natsuki, I believe. Mm -hmm. He's also Tanjiro in Japanese. That's oh. a little fun fact. He's Tanjiro from Demon Slayer. Oh, nice. That's the main character. That's I've the never, main character I've from Demon Slayer. Seen, people can crucify me. I've not seen a single episode. Yeah, of Demon that Slayer. is the main character from Demon Slayer. Okay. Yeah. He bought the shampoo and conditioner. Of course he did. Either that or he got it for free. But I, I want to say he was a good he, lad and he bought it. He sounds like an upstanding citizen who so, would buy it, yeah. Yeah, so he bought it and he took a picture of it and I was just like... And he bought the the Alice in Wonderland one because he's the dorm leader of Alice in Wonderland. Oh, good, yeah, so yeah. He bought, so he bought the shampoo uh, and he bought the conditioner. And mind you, once again, these are $55 and you have to pay them separately. That's 110 bucks. Also, there's a comb. Wait. There's a comb. You don't just drop the comb. There's a comb with the Twisted Wonderland logo. And then you have seven jewels on hold the on, comb. Hold on, hold on. How much is the comb? It's sold out, so I have no idea. Come on, Amazon. It's currently unavailable, though. Oh, my God. Oh, here we go. Here's a better picture. So you get this beautiful box. You're paying for the box. But yeah, here's a closer look at the logo. It's just a comb. <laughs> <laughs> it's literally just a comb. Okay, so back to Mansion City. <laughs> Get out of the shower. Looking for something to brush my hair. All there is is this fucking comb. <laughs> that thing looks cheap. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it does it look cheap. It looks fucking cheap, my guy. Oh, okay. Oh, what's this? Do you remember... I talked about the hair oil. The hair this is, oil. This is the hair oil. Oh no! <laughs> this is the hair oil and cream set that had me and cream. <laughs> what does that mean? Hair oil is one thing, and hair oil is something that a weird, disgusting-looking like merchant in Dungeons and Dragons sells you. Hey. Hey, you want my hair oil? It'll help. It's, I'm just doing the, the the fucking Goblin Merchant from a uh, Critical Role. Fuck. Um, was like, hey, you want buy my you want buy my hair oil? So yeah. And cream. What do you mean by cream? It literally says hair cream. Hair cream. So. I remember how I told you about the shampoo I lost my mind that day? Yes. This made my lose my mind even more because I think I found this the next day. Yeah, this hair and cream. So this comes in a set. Okay. It's $55. Okay, so that's... <laughs> so... We're at $165. Not including comb. And the thing is, when I share this, me and a bunch of mutuals... We wanted to get this, okay? But then we saw the price, and we're like, no way. And I said, you know why it's $55? Because they slapped the characters on this box. They slap a logo on it. And they slapped the logo on it and called it a day. Wasn't there some one of your mutuals that said that they can't wait to put it in their spaghetti? Oh, yeah. The, yeah, she said that. I'm like, uh, no. She's like, yes. And I'm like, no. My, my favorite part of Pops Night is when I put hair oil on my spaghetti. Yeah. I appreciated Chrissy for putting the hair oil on the spaghetti we had for my birthday. I appreciate that. But yeah, this is, this is $55, uh, this little set, because you get characters. And I'm like, you know what? This Same with the shampoo and conditioner. This better be the best damn shampoo and conditioner I've ever smelt in my life. This better be the best cream I've put in my hair. <laughs> hair cream. Why does this exist? Oh, and my favorite, colored wax. I figured, let's go with the whammy. Wait. We're going to go all three. Literally, this is color wax and it's based off the dorms once again so like is this like wax that you use for wax seals or is this wax that you melt on your bdsm partner's back like what do you use this for i don't think it's that i mean you could try okay back to mansion city for a moment <laughs> oh you go down in the basement you're with your boy <laughs> you're doing some heavy bdsm play oh my god he's like you like deeper voices like hey babe i can't wait to do the the wax play tonight and you're all like hell yeah just call me shirley just call me shirley <laughs> you know the hottest name for people in bsm <laughs> relationships just call me shirley and he's all like yeah shirley so like that's happening that's happening for a moment 
and you go and you're like, do you want the vill or do you want the riddle? And he's like, I want the riddle tonight. <laughs> and you grab the riddle and you start melting it over your back and you all have good cummy time. So that's how that works. Is that, is that, did I accurately, is that? Sure. Yeah, okay. Sure. <laughs> I was like, I don't know where I'm going with this. And the best part is, so, according to this picture, if I look at it right, so, this color of wax is actually the color of the dorms. I don't know if you can, depending yeah. on your hair color, if you can get it, because once I share, once again, I shared this, and everyone was like, I actually want this. And I'm so, very confused here. And someone said. Sorry I keep yawning, but yeah. How do you think I'm boring as I explain uh, the, the yeah. wonders of this merchandise to you? The wonders of this merch. Oh, boy. But I think depending on how dark your hair is, it's not going to show. Especially what, what if you get a certain... Oh, it's hair dye! I'm guessing it's hair because it's color wax. Oh! Girl put it in her hair. I thought it was the wax you melt on your partner during sexy cummy BDSM cummy times. No, this is just hair wax, but they call it ah. Sister Wonderland color wax because, you know. Well, my example still stands. You want to put color wax on your partner's back? I want to put hair dye on my partner's back. Okay. It'll be very colorful. You paint the rainbow because I'm gay as shit. Yep. <laughs> oh, boy. I think, I think uh-huh. we need to grab one more and then we make this a part two. Okay. So, choose a good one. Let's choose a good one to end this video. Choose a good one. A glass. What? what oh, 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 no. Oh. It comes in a box with oh. Mickey's logo again, so you oh, know it's this legit. Looks like, this looks like you got it from like a 50-year-old at a yard sale. <laughs> but oh. what it is, you don't know, remember those like glasses we had, like the Arizona ones that your sister gave us? It looks like the logo is going to peel off of that glass. It you know what? Really- it does. It looks very faded. Like it every looks picture I've very seen. Very cheap. I mean, for 12 bucks. This is what we drink our fucking beer during lit time in Mansion City at. Like we drink them out of the the Kareem Long Glass Twist. <laughs> <laughs> Call him Google Translate, right? <laughs> But yeah, uh, honey, the guests are here. Get the fancy glasses. <laughs> <laughs> oh. But yeah, just because hey, you want a long glass. Oh, that's a long glass twist. Oh, and by the way, postage is included and you can buy it right away. Yeah, oh, that sounds good. Uh, thank you. Thank you. What's the name of this place? Uh, Otomart. Thank you, Otomart. And the person's name is Su- Suyo Yan. Thank you, Suyan. At, At discount, discount negotiation, negotiation possible. At discount negotiation possible. So you can oh, haggle the price. If you don't want to pay 12 bucks, you could go down. Oh, man. I'm, but you know what? I'm I good would, at a haggling. I would pay 12 bucks for I this I would pay glass. 12 bucks for this cheap as fuck for glass. For Kar- Kar- Kareem Long Glass Twist. Kareem Long Glass Twist. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. There definitely is going to be a part two because you've got a lot more links to go through. I do. This is incredible. Thank you so much for starting to open my eyes. Did uh, you see the sign? I saw the sign and I Good. opened up my eyes. So thank you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoy <laughs> this and I hope you guys enjoy more Twisted Wonderland content. That will be coming very soon because I cannot wait to do record part two. We're, we're actually going to record part two like in a moment, but like it's going to be good. This is, oh my god. I need to rearrange the link so I don't pick the same thing again. This is amazing. This is so good. So fucking good. Thank you. Thank you, man. We love you guys. We love you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You've you've done, it's good good business. Good, good business. You've done good business. Yeah. You've done good uh, discount pleasure, negotiation possible. It's a, ple- it's a pleasure working with you. It's a pleasure it's, working with you. Thanks, man. Thank you. All right. You guys take care. We're going to continue doing very important stonk business, okay? Stonks. We'll see, stonks. <laughs> we'll see you guys next time. <laughs>